So this started with say, a photograph taken in Preston, which is where my studio is, of this couple. And I found a really fascinating relationship between them. And so that was in the days of printout photographs. So I just had a stack of photographs and I looked through them. And I knew at some point I wanted to paint them because it's something that you'll probably see in a lot of my work, the relationship between two figures in a close proximity. Um, so they were from one photograph and then I was painted in St. Anne's Square and did a little study about this big and I thought, I could do as a background, it might work. So I sort of did a little sketch and the painting's about this big. Um, so I put it together in the studio and repainted bits and invented this figure who for me is like an angel type figure. Like it's not by chance that the bit of, bit of light is at her back kind of thing. Although maybe nobody else in the world sees that, but for me it's important. Um, and, and painting in St. Anne's Square, I remember just one day painting one of the monuments and the guy was playing the violin right behind me. I thought, life does not get better than this. In the sunshine in St. Anne's Square and somebody's serenading me, like it's just wonderful. Anyway, so, I had it in the studio and it was, it was all right, the composition was good, but it didn't have that kind of life to the paintwork. So I brought, I came early one morning with this big board like this on my easel and just set up in St. Anne's Square and basically repainted the whole background as fast as I could uh, before it got too busy. Because the kind of marks that you get, you know, these summary marks, they're really hard to get in the studio when there's no time pressure, when the subject isn't changing, when, the, when there's not that real buzz about things. So a lot of the process of painting is to bring out the best aspects of each process. You can paint everything from photographs, and many artists do, and do it successfully. But for me, the combination of painting from life, painting from photos, painting from invention, painting from drawings, brings a more roundedness to my paintings and a more imaginative effect. 